一輪公開はよく誤解されてしまう専門分野です多くの人々が気がついて,気がつい,ていないのは一輪公開は実際は外科的な専門分野ということですそして単に診療所で診察治療をするというのが本来の姿ではありませんそして彼らは美化された花ほじり屋というわけでもありませんむしろ全てのこと単純で分かりやすい施術から頭部首のあたりの複雑なが,がんの切除手術そして再建手術すべてを行いますまた自鼻公開は聴力や内耳の前提検査を行うのが仕事ではありませんこれは聴力教育機能の専門医が行いますしかしその検査結果を分析して必要があれば治療や薬の処方を行います医学部を卒業した後の卒業した後は5年間のカテゴリカル確定学のプログラムに進みます通常は5年間のプログラムになります時には7年間のプログラムもありますがこれは研修が含まれているためですしかし5年間が通常となります最初の年はインターン生の年と呼ばれますがこの時期は防線処方することが必要ですさまざまな科を回りますこれは他のどの専門家での研修と変わりません ICU での経験を受けたり麻酔科医眼科医形成外科医そして一般総合外科などさまざまな科を回り研修を受けますそして数ヶ月は自民公開の研修を受けますページャーを持ち歩きそして診察診療をインターン生としてどのように対処するのかを学びます2年目以降は、自備公開、専属、専門でローテーションをします。2年目、3年目になると、だんだんと手術の経験が増えてきます。そして、自備公開内での専門文化での経験も増えてきます。4年目、5年目になると、自分の後輩の指導を行ったりそして解剖学の知識も増え卒業に向けて自分自身で指導医として治療を行うようになりますこれがとても楽しい部分ですなぜなら自分自身であまり監督されずに手術ができるからですより複雑な症例になると指導医の補助などを行います。自民公開はとても競争率の高い分野です。そして常に5位にランクインしています。それは皮膚科医、形成外科医、神経外科医、そして形成整形外科医の次です。多くの研修医、自民公開の研修医が点数 USMLB2 の点数を248点そしてステップ 2C 系の試験結果を256点の点数を取っていますそして出版物の価格は 13.7 個出版物があります医学部生の中でも自民効果に進みたいと思っている人たちは細部にこだわるという性質を持っていることが多くとても頑張り屋さんでと少し変わっている人が多いですそして優しい親切な大石さん、でかいさんと病院の中では思われているでしょう。Lose weight scientifically confirmed the, your hero to lose weight and as, as for losing weight. 
the food that was what we are going to talk about today. Among those watching this video, video, I'm sure there are a lot of people who are trying to lose weight out there. There's so many books about losing weight and dieting, and most of them are best. There are a lot of best-selling books related to dieting and losing weight that tells us that how many people are trying to lose weight out there, especially. But particularly for women, they want to increase, make their appearance better. So this is this could be one of the reasons they're working on losing weight. But not only appearance, there are so many bad effects. Uh, as for being obese, that's what. Let me highlight on the bad side of being obese. It causes a lot of diseases. As we get older, we get back pain, knee pain. There are so many people start feeling those pain in their body. As we get older, our the amount of our muscles and bones, they, those things start decreasing. The things that supports our body starts decreasing, and the our power strength start weakening. And if the be, being obese get added to that situation, our pain gets more increased ba leg pain, knee pain, and back pain gets worse. So even though even we get older, we want to be able to walk on our feet and run and travel. So it is very important for us to keep our muscles. And in addition to that, it is very important for us to prevent being obese. So far, I've been working on this. I've been working so hard. So after retirement, I'm going to do whatever I want to after retirement. I'm sure those, a lot of people are dreaming this. But playing sports that you like or traveling around the world to visit lots of places, healthy body is prerequisite. Weakening body or being obese, such body conditions, it's, it's going to be difficult for you to do the activity that you like. Being obese, not only weakening your body, but it causes a lot of diseases such as diabetes, hypertension, and lifestyle-related diseases. Being obese, having been obese is can cause you a lot of diseases if you leave obesity untreated you can your life of quality can decrease and you can add a lot of burden to your blood vessels so strokes cardio infarction or your blood vessel is going to get stiffened. Such diseases can happen with if you are obese. So I hope you, I, I was, I could raise awareness how being obese is d dangerous, especially for Japanese people. It is we are not good at digesting insulin so we need to be careful to keep our body fit and I what I'd like you to get motivated to lose weight now let's talk about the food that help you lose weight a lot I'm going to talk about the, the food that helps you lose weight because to lose weight, dieting is very important. What you eat matters. Of course, exercising or working out works to some point, to some extent. But food, what you eat is more important. So if you want to lose weight, you want to review what you eat or your eating habit. 
to lose weight. There are 90% of dieting or losing weight. In lose weight, 90% is food to lose weight. So I would like you to avoiding food that help that makes you fat is very important. The food that makes you food. I've already talked about this. I've talked to, I've talked, I've introduced those food already in the previous video. If you are not, if you haven't watched this video, I have linked to that video to the in the description below. So I would like you to check this video as well. But in this video, I would like to introduce the food that help you lose weight. The food that you've been eating, the food that makes you food. I would like you to replace those food with the food that I'm going to introduce today in in this video. Let's get it started. The the food that I would like you to introduce first is watermelon. If I say watermelon, it is it's a sweet food. I'm sure a lot of people consider this a sweet food. Why? How does watermelon help us lose weight? Well, I'm going to explain this and make it sim simple so you so it's easy to understand. Well, do you know you've heard watermelon dieting? It's the diet was one of the diet method to to lose weight. Watermelon is very effective to lose weight, and ninety percent of watermelon is water. Ninety percent is it's almost the water in addition to lots of water it is low in calories that's very attractive right surprisingly 90 there's only 30 kilo calories per 100 grams and there's a lot of studies that shows watermelon helps you lose weight and there are in some studies, those who keep eating watermelons for four weeks, they 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 lose weight and their BMI in decreased. And there are a lot in watermelon. There are a lot of elements called flavonoid in watermelon. That study in 2016. Those who are consuming lots of food that has lots of flavonoid, they tend to lose weight, and watermelon includes lots of flavonoid. So it is enough to say that watermelon help you lose weight.